This is Sapphire Chow, and welcome back to this marvel of a game known as Sonic Adventure 2 Battle featuring Chow Garden. Or actually, more, it's more Chow Garden featuring Sonic Adventure 2 Battle because this is the only part of the game that I really do the most work in. Alrighty then, let us go. Over here, we have our uh, gallery lobby with us, and of course, a gallery lobby skin. So that's pretty cool and awesome and funkalicious. Let's go see, or let's go, uh, has a, get, get, get your butt band down here, <laughs> why are you so high? Jeez, you, that, 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 that flies, seriously. Didn't think that the flight was that good, but hey, here's Hazard, full level 99, and cleaned up his animal parts, so he's well on the way of being a neutral run run. We have here a very fancy looking chuckle. I really like this. Um, they are sort of all we very well on the way of um, being a mega evolution, and because they're, they're in, like a regular color chow, they're all getting all transparent and stuff. So yeah, I, I haven't fully maxed out their their uh, evolution, so I might do something with that. Um, and also, you might notice that the uh, there's a slightly different face mod going on here. So there's also Mirror's anime face mod, I believe. That's what it's based from. So yeah, so looking at like a Jaws <laughs> variety here, but uh, I do really like it, it's pretty cool. It's a nice face for Chuckle. Oh, we have another edge, uh, semi-edge lord here. This is Shaq. Shaq is uh, well into their second evolution. I don't want to keep developing the second evolution because uh, we can mega, mega evolve them into their fly second evolution. You may also notice their eyes are no longer edgy. Because you can now finally we have a nice mod made by Darky Benji himself that actually removes that mandatory requirement that all Dark Chow have mean eyes. So now that we have that, we can actually retain the Chow's face instead of it losing its uh, its original eyes. So that's pretty cool. And someone wants to. I, okay, I, 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 I could see you in the corner here. Chow gets stuck here very easily. They can't easily walk up here. Okay, here we go. Let's, let's take you up to this cliff here. By the way, this is an updated Cinder Cove. Uh, thingamajig here, this, this particular texture mod made by Akuhime, so there we go, he's, he's, they're all swimming into the lava, which is perfectly fine and safe, that is that is definitely fine, definitely fine for a chow like you, Salad, which is made of leaves, so uh, yeah, Salad's all, all, all fine and dandy here for their second evolution, I think they are a neutral swim swim type, so there we go, and uh, thank you Shaq, thank you Sha Shaq very much. Um, who else is, do we, who else do we need to look for? Hang on, what, what's, what's going on here? Oh yeah, we got the edgy ritual. Oh, we see the edgy ritual much better here. It's a lot clearer, maybe. Or maybe there's just a texture underneath it. Um, you know, normally I think Chaos would be burning alive in this because they like water and they don't really, I don't know if Chaos would work very well in, um, in lava because normally they like to hide in water. Alright, now uh, there's another chair I'm looking for. I wonder where the hell they're gone. Where are they? Pretty sure I've got another chow around here. Where, where the hell's Crater? Where, oh, there, there's Crater! How the hell did you end up there? You're, you're, you're being impaled by the, the fence. That's nice to know. Anyway, we might do a few little things with Crater here. They're also full level 99. Actually, we should probably get, to get a nice close-up on their uh, their face here. Hang on, I'm in the water. I mean, I mean I'm in the lava. It's got to get te technicalities right. It looks, looks very adorable as is. The little anime looking face there. But I want to get to back to your regular default face. Stop being so happy and let me show you your default face. I must see it. Also, uh, looks like Chaos has like, there we go. So it looks like they're slightly drooling a bit. <laughs> it's a bit similar to Akuhime's face mod there, but um, yeah. And also like when you are holding a Chow as Chaos, um, it looks like you have like four hands. Because yeah, the silhouette thing doesn't always work very well. Another thing. That's very nice. So this here is this this is this is Zach. For those who remember the the all E Chow that's never gonna evolve ever. Um okay, we get two rounds of radio there. But yeah, I, I found uh, out of all these chow out of all the chow in this garden, it is always Zach normally that is turning on the radio. So obviously they have nothing better to do and just listen to the radio all the time. It's fair enough. Okay, we'll see. You can also see the glitchy, the eye, thanks to this uh, texture. Anyone else wants to enjoy some radio time? Come on, Hazard. I know you like a little bit of music, so you're part of the boy band. 
can just self check. Oh, what the hell? Um, okay, I did not mean that to happen. Um, uh, you know, actually, you know what? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's just go. Let's go. Let's let's go out of here. Let's show you. What okay. Oh, firstly, I was not expecting that to happen to, to Hazard to go, naturally go into their um, mating season, but I want to go up here. And then go to a uh, club chow with our Dreamcast thingamajig, give me all the fun stuff. Now, I want to go and get to Blossom. Because Blossom is the chow. I want to do a bit of breeding with, um, in alongside Hazard. So we can maybe get some interesting colour mixture. I have no idea what sort of re results we'll get, but you never know. We could get something nice. I don't know. I don't know if Blossom's horny enough to, to mate, but, um... Who knows? I, I honestly don't know. No, I don't- oh, no, okay, okay, but... Blossom clearly is not uh, interested at the moment. We will change that in a moment. Hang on a second. Where is Blossom? Blossom's right here. Um, oh yeah, your designer mate's not, not, not high enough. There we go, I think we've fixed that. Surprise no other chair I've gone after Hazard. <laughs> okay, that's fine. That's fine. Let's do some breedings. The cool thing here is, um, Blossom can either pass over the yellow or... Oh, hey, that's interesting. Either the yellow, as is noted in this particular egg, or the purple gene. And also there's shiny uh, options as well as two tones. So we can get some really cool combinations here. Now let me just do another round. Well, I've breed them maybe two or three times. Now where is... Where's, where's Hazard? There's Hazard. I'm trying to find Hazard and Fusion Shower Editor. There we go. Now you're both the nice and horny again. There, as we can see. Thank you, Shaq, for um, worshiping Chaos. I mean, Chaos is technically like a, a god or a deity for Chow, so I guess that makes sense. Come on, let's get something fancy. Let's get something fancy. Oh, okay. Um, okay, I think we've got a monotone shiny here. It was interesting. Uh, Maybe that actually looks like it. Ooh, we look really, really fitting as a chaos chair. If this is the chaos color, that'd be super fitting. Like, I, I really want to do. No, of course you have to be sleeping right right now. I wanted to breed you guys one last time, just one more for the road. Um, I don't know which one I'll, I'll keep. I might keep one. I might not. I'll pro I, will, I will probably keep one, but you know. Now, where are you? Here you are. All right, make more babies. Thank you. Ooh, that's... Okay, so we've got three interesting combinations here. Again, what we see in these eggs might not represent exactly what's in the inside, maybe? Actually, maybe they will. Um, oh, let's, 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 go, let's go with egg number one. Egg number one's a yellow one. So let's, let's go. I'm, I'm pretty excited. What, what, what are we going to get out of this? This is going to be pretty cool. Alright, so let's... They're doing that chuckle. You do. You're doing good. You, you're doing a good. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. What's what? Oh, we got the lucky chow. We got a bucket head. <laughs> okay. Um, this is new. I'm. I'm really. I'm really glad we got a chow that actually was born with a hat, which is really rare. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. Um. Okay. Chow number two. Um, I probably actually should- I, I kind of want to know what these chow really look like uh, without the, the skins. It's kind of hard to compare. Thanks, Chuckle. Alright, let's see. What, what do we got next? What do we got next? <laughs> this hazard is walking out into it. Okay, yeah, different different colours here. Different colour. Um, it's like a lighter purple thingy. And it's a little bit edgy. Okay. That's interesting. Alright, so now let's... Uh, Hang on, what's this? is Salad just... <laughs> Salad's trying to get the food. Okay, fair enough. It's impossible for Chow to get anything up here. Okay, here you go. You want, you want your food so badly. Alright, egg number three. Let's go. Let's go. Now, this is obviously a bright Chow. Let's see what we get. Oh, oh my god! Is that, was that what I think it is? Oh, that is a beautiful face. I love this face. This face. 10 out of 10 face. 
Very facey. I do like this face. I actually want to know what the face of this chow, but... I'd... Or maybe I should not know what the, <laughs> this chow looked like. That is so cool. I love the fact that this was born with a hat. Oh, I don't know. Like, I like this one because it's face. But I like I like the fact that we actually get a lucky chow wearing a hat. It's just... Oh, it's just so... Actually, oh, well, look at the stats, actually. Let, actually, let's check the stats in... Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Like, I don't know, I think, I, I, I don't have high hopes for its grades, but you, you never know. Could be surprised. And I blo blossom in like four Ds or something in its <laughs> great, you know, stats, so, you know. Um, A, D, A, C, D. Okay, two A's, that's not bad. The Chow is healthy, that's good to know from, uh, from that standpoint. Um, let's see the doctor. What's this? Chow is very healthy. Yeah, they take a good chair. Who's this? No! Okay, I, I maybe don't have the mod where they say interesting things. Okay. <laughs> um, never mind. I have to maybe fix that. This is I am using a new computer here, so um, hopefully things work better. But of course, I have to remember to re-install re all the mods that I had beforehand. Um, but I, I do like I do like this chow. This looks a nice looking chow. Um, let's see. It looks a bit similar to Zach, which I don't like as much though. But um, oh well. And who's who's fluting? Who's fluting? Who? What the hell? How did you get on the way there? All right, never mind. Ah, Blossom's fluting. That's nice. You're, you're playing a flute with your chin. Okay. Um, where, where's our boy band? Come on. As, as part of the boy band, I command you to uh, join in. There we go. That's nice. Good stuff. Where, where's the, uh, where, where are we? Where's, where's the boy bands? No, no, you're not part of the boy band. No, no not you, Zach. Zack is essentially just a, a, a table decoration. It's just like an ornament. Just, just, just chucking it there for the sake of putting it there. And you're drowning. Sorry. Let's get you involved. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh no, I finished. Rip. All right. Uh, let's go check out the other, other chair that we have. Um, so bucket head we've done. Let's go with monotone, shiny. It's, it, it's an interesting color. I think it was. Um, so that's a mix of yes, yeah, so, uh, powder blue and purple. It's a good thing we had a bit of diversity of uh, results here. Now let's go see what you have to say. D. <laughs> it's all D's. This chow is the D. We have an all E chow, and now we have an all D chow. <laughs> That's pretty kind of weird. <laughs> D, I was not expecting that. Chow is oh, chow is relaxed. Okay. Um. Yeah, you don't have much to say. Yes. Yeah, this chow looks very relaxed. I kind of beg to differ because I look a little bit angry and energetic as well. So if they're energetic, I don't think they would be relaxed. All right then. Well, um, let's go check this little third chow. Let's go. Where is it? It's like a, it's like a minty looking chair. Where are we? Fine. Where on earth? Are they, are they over here somewhere? Oh, no, that you're there. Oh, it kind of sucks that you you spawn right there when you can't swim. All right. Uh, here we go. I lo okay, okay, I love, love, love this face. Love this face. This is a good face. I was really hoping to get like a really sleepy looking chow. <laughs> I just, I just, I just like this. I, f I find I find like dozy or tired eyes look really like I really underrated. I think it's just let's just, let's see what the medical chart says. Okay, well it's not as good as the other the buckethead actually had the two A's. So hmm, this child looks lonely. Oh, that's sad face. All right. Um, again, uh, I think I might accept some names for. This bright chow, and uh, maybe for the bucket head. I, I I feel like I can't I can't really choose between the two of them. I really like them both equally. Uh, as for the other one, I might give that away somewhere, someplace, probably in the Discord live chat. So do keep watch that space. Um, we have a lot of chow here. <laughs> I just realised. Uh, where's Blossom? I should probably take Blossom back to their garden. Where 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 are they? Where the hell's Blossom go? I need to rescue you again. Good thing I don't have the drowning code on, otherwise you would be dead by now. Um, the drowning code is legitimately um, t horrifying. I just know why I don't want to use it. Um, but you never know, I might do a hard mode playthrough of this game, putting all the hard mode codes on. 
uh, which would be quite interesting. But since we are using a more fancy looking thingamajig, oh, hey, hey, get your butt over here, wine. Wine. Okay, you want to do more. Okay, you're tired. But um, yeah, so you, so you spawned us on the water. You're looking really nice there, wine. I do like that quite a lot. Actually, I find that your, your skin really is fitting for Club Chow with this color scheme. Anyways, here's our party pooper, Prism. And yeah, you might notice I've also changed his face back to his original face that he was born with. So there we go. So I'm really glad that I'm actually get his little squinty eyes again. So just to uh, mix it up a bit. Um, oh yes, we have a guest here. Which I probably mentioned. We have Blazu, which is another Korimori Chow. So they look a bit more edgy. This is what, this is what kind of what Prism's eyes would normally look like. But uh, yeah, Blazu here I thought look, would, would chill out well with uh, Prism, given that the, uh, they're pretty much the very, like, they're essentially the same typing, it's just one's a bit more mega evol evolved than the other. What are you going to do? Oh, you're going to go on the horsey! That's adorable. Let's, let's, let's just enjoy a moment of you enjoying the horsey. Good job, Blazu. Yosh. All right, so let's uh, let's go have a look here in. Where are we going? I know where we're going next. The next place we're going is in here. And uh, the two chow that I wanted to do stuff with are both asleep, so that's really useful. Anyways, let's go have a look at Chiro here. Oh, Chiro looks pretty cool. <laughs> okay, okay, Chiro's face looks really nice, as well as this from this uh, particular skin. Um, you look no different. I'll let you guys uh, do your own thing there. Hang on. Oh yeah, potato looks pretty cool. Nice and uh, purpley, purpley potatoes. Purple potatoes are a thing, I, th I, I believe so. I think there might be a variety of potatoes that's, that's purple. Yeah, that looks really nice. That is very, very nice. Um, oh, and, uh, <laughs> what's going on here? <laughs> They've merged as one. Why final? Seriously, final? I thought you had better standards than that. But out of all the chow to merge with, you had to uh, merge with trash. I mean, granted, trash is probably no longer the trashiest chow that's goes to, that goes to now, that, that now goes to Zack, but still. I think tra trash still owns the title of being total trash, just, just so you know. So I'm, I'm not changing their name, they're just going to stay as they are. But yes, Jerry here, being in their second evolution, they can uh, pass on the red gene, while Nebula over here could pass on the purple. So I'm thinking of maybe bringing these two and just seeing what we happen to get out of that. Um, I will probably have to wake them up using Fusion Star Editor just to speed this up, so let us do that. Um, let's, let's find where they are at. You are now awake and horny, and I will now wake up the beast, that is Jerry. Here we go. Now we got two miniature edgelords breeding it out there, so we might give birth to something absolutely terrible. You never know, because they're both edgy. Oh, that looks good. I think we got ourselves a two-tone. Two-tone mixed color chill. Which would be super nice. Come on, let's let's look let's look at him. Let's look at him. Oh, that's oh, another swirly chair. Wait, hang on. I want to let's look at its face. It's probably look. Oh, it's a happy swirly. I see, we seem to have a lot of these chair. They have little swirly eyes. Oh, that's, that's that's quite nice. It's a. Uh, not something you'd expect out of uh, a two rather edgy chow, but hey, that, that could work. Pretty interesting. Oh yes, and uh, by the way, final screaming face looks pretty amazing. If I can get you to, to show your regular face. Here we go, he's happy! He's a happy boy! Happy boy! And 
and we've got some musics. Who's musicking? Ah, oh, you guys are musicking. So now everyone likes trash. Now the trash is no longer being trashy. Okay. Oh, I was hoping that the, the glitch wouldn't might happen. Sometimes when you pause. All right. Chiro. Join the band. There we go. Got plenty of band action on happening here today. It's always nice. There you go. Enjoy your balls there, Nebula. Yeah, so we made ourselves four very nice looking chow there. Um, I'm not 100% uh, again I really like the bucket head and the other minty bright chow that we got there because we haven't got a, another bright chow apart from prison but as for this one I, I might consider raising it into something but yeah I'm not sure just yet not sure just yet but let, let me know what you guys think always open to suggestions and we're back again as the Amy and uh, I want to do a little bit of raising for the boy band because you might notice they all sort of I mean they used to have matching outfits but now they're a bit more individual so uh, we're just gonna do a few more little extra things and I probably need to rescue someone from drowning that's you all right I'm gonna check you oh, I'll check you right here I don't think you'll move if I take you here so that'd be fine Okay, so the chow that I am looking for is uh, Shack, Shackity Shack Shack, because Shack is back, back to the Shack. Yeah, so as a general rule of thumb, a chow, if you have a mod enabled for, um, if you've got a particular mod that's enabled, uh, that allows uh, Chow to become Mega Evolved. It requires a point value of 2,000 or more in any s any particular stat. So for Shaq here, they can definitely become a Mega Evolved um, Dark Swim Fly, but they can't become a Mega Evolved Dark Swim Swim, for example, because that swim stat's not yet at 2,000. So yeah, unfortunately, the only the only good scrade that that Shaq's got is uh, yeah, just fly. So let's just exploit that and. Uh, make them really interesting. They, which they already do look quite interesting, so... Yeah, I just wanted to keep maximizing that out. Even after level um, 99, um, you can still do a lot of stuff with their second evolution. So you can still mess around with their second evolution if you've already got everything all level 99, which is great. You can hear all those chow that want to swim that are probably all stuck in the tombstone graveyard thing. There we go. Oh, this is... Yeah, Shaq's looking awesome now. We must keep going. Let's go full capacity. Yeah, these chairs are super noisy. I think I've added the extra. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> I did not see that coming. Excuse me. Excuse moi. Don't you know? You, you're you're going to have a timeout. I'm going to put your timeout somewhere. Let's chuck you somewhere that you cannot escape. Let's take you right here. Let's put you here. There we go. You are literally within. <laughs> you are literally within the tombstone. You're one with tombstone. You are you're no longer leaving ever. Um, where's Shaq gone? Where did Shaq? Oh, there you are. No, I don't want to pet you. I wanted to pick you up. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I was not expecting that just to come out of nowhere. Seriously. I guess that, that, that happens when you got a bunch of baby chow everywhere, so, uh, you know. So, yeah, we have, lots, we have lots of chow. We have a lot of chow now. We've got like 23 chow in this file right now. So, yeah, it's almost at full capacity. So, let me just check your magnitude at the moment. Oh, hang on. Yeah, okay, so you're at maximum influence for fly. I don't think I can just, uh, do that any further. But look at that wingspan. That wingspan's looking really nice. And those uh, those horns are pretty cool too. So I like that. Shaq is looking very, very fancy there. Now, the other chair I wanted to do more stuff is with another... We all happen to be asleep, so that's really, really helpful. Thank you. 
you know what, I'm gonna get all these babies, all these little crawling chow, I'm just gonna chuck you all here. You one with this tombstone. Hello. How you going there? Doing good? That's good. Where's the other chow? You're still there? Alright, I'm gonna chuck you there. You're, you're, you're going, you're, you're being banished here as well. You're all banished. This is the chow magnet here. I'll even chuck you here, Zach, because, um, there we go. Excuse me, you're not supposed to leave that spot. You're supposed to stay here permanently. There we go. You can all just chill there. See, this is this is, this is how you babysit. You just find a place that they can't escape, you know? And then, uh, ex ex excuse me, you're not supposed to escape that. <laughs> you're just supposed to clip right through it and not move. No move. Okay, maybe we need to find another spot for you to stay. Um, let's, let's go. Let's go to this one here. I think you'll, st you'll stay here nicely. There we go. Nicely clipped through there. Thank you. Now you can stay there and not cause any trouble. Um, yes, so we want to do something with you. And it's always the thing with the chow that I need is always asleep. So, let's go back to you, Chuckle. I think I need a couple more uh, chaos drives with you before you're completely maxed out with your influence and fly. So let's do the waking up. There we go. Awaken! And yeah, and these uh, Chaos Drives are the slightly better ones, so they give a bit extra. A little bit extra just to, just to speed things up, really. So that is looking a lot more... Yeah, the spark's going up a bit more. I think that's going to be everything. I don't know if I can do that anymore. It was, it was already pretty advanced to begin with, and I did not mean to do that. <laughs> I just realised, I think I've also enabled the... Uh, yeah, I've enabled the rolly thing. I should probably be careful of that. So, yes, I think Chuckle is maxed out there. Yes, they are. Alright. So I think just give it a bit of time for their magnitude to grow and they'll just become even more distorted than they already are. So that'll be great. <laughs> yeah, so I think the boy band is pretty much done in terms of their, um, their looks and their stats. So yes, boy and band is now complete. It's great. Now I need to find a place to put all these things here. I'll make a nice collection of eggs, you know, just a uh, just a nice uh, nice diversity. Like a little gallery of eggs we got here. No, I didn't want to mean to do that. Sorry. What the? No! What the? Where, where the hell did you go? Okay, I did not mean to do that. What? No, I don't want to hurt you. Under no circumstances do I want to hurt you. I just, I literally just stood there, and you went flying. I did not, I did not want to do that. No, I will keep petting you. I will keep petting you. So I didn't want to hurt you. Sorry. I'm sorry, Salad. I didn't want to do that. You know what really sucks though is when you do, when you accidentally hit the chow. I think it was when you land on them. It takes away like 30 happiness, so I need to like recover that now. I need to recover it so you can you're in sh you can still live on forever and ever and ever when your remaining life goes to zero, so you can reincarnate. Because that's what I want. I don't want to do anything bad to you. I want to I want to make you happy. I want to make it do you happy. I don't want you to do a sad. No sads allowed. We do not take sads. That's another way to increase its happiness. Yes, I need to be careful of pressing these buttons, these ones here. And, okay, hi, hi camera. Camera, camera! <laughs> ah, good old cameras. Are they still stuck here? Well, two of them are at least. Uh, maybe not. Okay. Well, it looks like they can stay. They sort of do stay there after a while, which is still useful. No, no sads. I didn't want to hurt you. No. No sadding. We don't want to do a sad. And I'm somehow pitting you as well, so that's fair enough. I'm not even touching you. 
Not even touching the other chow, and I'm still petting them somehow. This is just magical sorcery. Let's just casually turn you into a hero chow while we're, while we're at it. Oh, do you want to join in too, Zack? Okay, Zack's in now included in the in the petting glitch. Fair enough. Um, <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Fair enough. This is a thing. I just realized the chow um, get the hearts a lot quicker when they're sitting down as opposed to standing up. This is a good comparison for you guys if you want to like go really fast with um, I don't know speedrun strats or something. Just make sure they're sitting down and you're petting them. All right, now where, where's your happiness at now, Salad? You're at 80. That's good. Good. Very good. 80 happiness. 81 now. Let's give you another fruit. 82 happiness. Oh yeah, I just realized, uh, since every, all the whole boy band now has um, all their gardening implements, it's now really useful for them to uh, go and do gardening related stuff and uh, worshipping trees. And also worshipping Amy while they're at it too, because uh, they also like to do that as well. Oh, it's adorable. And now it's all good. Now we're all good here. And we have a third band today. Alright, let's see if we can get the whole boy band involved. I know you're hungry, but you know, we have bands to do. We must sacrifice everything for boy band. Oh, you were sleeping? Sorry. Okay, well, it looks like... <laughs> um, well, Shaq silly has other better things to do. Right, let's, see, let's get Chuckle. Maybe Chuckle, gladly. Get involved. And Zach is one of the groupies, apparently. And has it's too busy being tired. I'm sorry, I, I didn't know you were asleep. <laughs> oh, fine then. You're gonna sleep through all that. Alright, well, at least Zach made a good groupie. Back again with some more stuff, another character change, because why not? Um, I just realized those two chow are going for the same fruit. That's very nice to know. Here you go. Fruit to go around. Only because I just kind of want to. Because I feel like with Crater, Crater could work well with uh, like some animal parts, and I'm thinking I might give them some rabbits. As to why I want to give them rabbits, well, there's actually a bit of a reason behind that, but I want to give you the reason while I'm actually. Oh, wait, someone's drowning. Somebody drowning. Yes, it's you. Of course it's you. You're the, you're the one who's always getting into trouble, aren't you? Alright, let's just let's just chuck you right in here. Let's just say stay put right there. Uh, and then it's for you. Because you probably well, dang it. Oh my god, you jump so high. There we go. Alright then, so... I just realized there's a high concentration of chow in this very location. <laughs> and they've literally become one. Okay, this is like the whole trash and final again, except it's Hazard and the Bucket Chow. Okay. Now, where is Krator? I'm looking for Krator, because I want, I want to give Krator something. Where the hell's Krator gone? Wait, there you are. Alright, Krator. I want to give you rabbit parts. Now, why I, I, I give them rabbit parts? Well, a bit of an interesting trivia thing. So, for anyone who might be familiar with, like, Japanese culture and mythology and all that fun stuff, you know, like, I know from where I'm from, when people say, oh, look, there's a moon, they, they people think that they see, like, a face or a man in the moon or whatever. But, um, but in Japanese culture, they don't see a man in the moon, they see a rabbit in said moon. I mean, and also the fact that rabbits get re re referenced a lot in moons and things like that. If anyone's who played, is anyone who has played, um, Okami? Um, when the moon power-up was given to you by a rabbit? Um, in the WarioWare, there are space rabbits. Uh, Mario, Mario Odyssey, there are rabbits on the moon. So, it's literally a very Japan thing. 
to include uh, rabbits and moons because apparently they go together like salt and pepper or something like it's just just a thing that happens in their culture and it's just a reference that gets used quite a lot even with um, was a rhythm heaven uh, mega mix there was also a particular rhythm mini game that was uh, relating to a rabbit going to the moon so there you go there's a lot of references to moons and rabbits and that's just a thing that Japan likes to reference all the time so there you go. Also, I'm going to see what's going to happen, what's this going to end up looking like when I maximize fly and run for Crater, given that they both got 2,000 in both stats. So we could get a very interesting looking mix here. And uh, Crater will also become a wascally little rabbit as well, so that's always another nice thing. Um, okay, we got some more radio time, and that's exactly the same song that we just listened to earlier, so... Pretty sure there's other songs, like there's heaps of other songs out of all of them. You chose that one, so okay. I don't know what I'm gonna do with all these extra rabbits. I should probably give them to the other chow. Uh, not to Zack though, this would be useless against Zack. Um, oh, you're both asleep. Okay, well that's nice to know. Oh. Wait, they're all asleep. Okay. Never mind. Alright, I'm just gonna spam some rabbits on this bucket of chow. Maybe learn to walk or something. Again, I don't know what, what type will make them just yet. I don't even know if I- Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't wanna do that. I don't wanna do the dude then. Anyways. Um, I want- yeah, I just want- just want to get these, uh... I don't want to do that! I don't... Fine, do that. Yeah, I just realised, I think this, this is just a uh, rolling uh, mod, it's probably a bit too dangerous. Um, hang on. There we go. And... you! Because you've got an A rank in the run, so that might be useful. Oh, that's adorable. Trying to give this last little rabbit while well, there's so many other chow around. There we go. And somebody's a drowning. Oh no, I didn't want to do that. No, I wanted to pick you up. Thank you. And now you hate me. I know, I'm sorry. I don't want to hurt you. Oh, look, we'll sort you out later. We'll when, 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 when we actually do a bunch of things with you and raise your stats, I'm sure your happiness will go back to 100, so that should be fine. I know everything will be okay. Okay, Yorsh. It's just, just Yorsh. We'll, we'll put you back to a neutral. <laughs> yeah, we'll take you back to neutral then, alright? Alright, I was going to give a few more of these to you, because that will, and after that, we should maximize your influence and in fly. And I think we'll think that will pretty much do you. So now, not only will you be a Mega Revolve channel, but you'll also be a mix of two things. And I really want to pick that up, but I can't because Zach's in the way. There we go. There we go. Oh my god, what the hell? <laughs> I told you to pick. No, don't pet it. I want you to. Oh my god, seriously. I should really turn off this mod. I seriously need to turn off that mod. 
Oh god, alright. I should probably give you more pets. More petting, alright. I'll, I'll, I'll make you all happy again. Because everything is going to be okay. Yeah, happiness is at 20. Look, look, you'll be fine once I start racing you normally. So yes, don't worry. It's all good. And we're back again, but we are not done quite yet. Because I also want to have another go at making a decent greater chow. So we have A A A C D. Yeah, I just I didn't go too interesting here with their names. I just was going by what their phenotype was. And we've got E B A S S. So in the best case scenario, we'll have a chow with three A's and two S's, and that'll be really great to have. So let us do that and let us breed these chow endlessly and see how we go with time. Um, I will have this, this extra long episode to make up for the fact that I didn't have an episode last week. So yes, there you have it. I'm going to have a nice long episode for you all. Hopefully, uh, otherwise maybe just, just find, find a way to watch this episode on like speed up or something. I don't know, maybe that might work if, you, if you're stuck for time. But yes, I really want to want to do something with this. Um, and maybe and hopefully get something awesome. Oh, cool. Cool. we might actually get some interesting chow as well from all this. So yes, we'll keep breeding these. Keep breeding these endlessly until we get something that we really want. Um, and it might take a while though because, again, I'm relying on a lot of RNG. And uh, as we all know with RNGesus, they require a bit of RNG themselves. And yeah, I know we have, uh, we have a lot of... I know because of all the inbreeding that's been going on, uh, the dual texture seems to be the most prevalent at the moment, so... Yeah, but we have we might get some interesting colour mixes and all that nice stuff. So I'm just gonna keep on breeding. Just keep on breeding. So we'll keep breeding until we have a full garden and then we'll compare. We'll probably go go to um We'll go to the medical center and then see if we can uh, surprise ourselves with another nicely graded chow. And I'm, I'm perfectly happy just to get a chow that has mostly A's and a couple of S's, which would be really great. And then I can just reincarnate them multiple times just to, just to, um, yeah, when, when, when uh, doing all things. Is that a different colored chow egg for this one? That's interesting. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Um, yeah, so I think, I think if we have a nice fancy looking, uh, range of some grades. I'm pretty lenient in that regards because we can always just reincarnate and evolve them endlessly and do all that stuff so that's that's probably what the game plan will probably entail. So we've got another great so we got we've got a white and an off-white <laughs> one. Hopefully we can get a few more reds as well. So that is six, seven, eight. So we have a full garden right now, but I think we can keep, keep breeding them because we I have, I have disabled the uh, the breed limit mod or, or enabled the breed breed limit mod so it prevents uh, things from happening. For anyone who remembers the time when I tried breeding potato and trash together and they ended up having like no eggs being produced at all. So I don't think that's going to happen here because I've got a nice empty file here so we can breed as much as we like right right as we can see here. I could breed it enough to the point that we can almost have 24 chow in this garden, but I think it will lag pretty hardcore, so I don't want to break this game. Um, yeah, it wouldn't be a very good idea if I did that. And someone- oh, we've already got some uh, hatching, naturally. Oh, that's nice to know. And they're all- they're all dual chow. <laughs> they're all duels. <laughs> that's kind of funny. Alright, um, since some are already starting to hatch, maybe I might have to start making the effort to, uh, Faces like uh, okay. All right, I think yeah, they're all they're all dual chow. I, I know it's an, it's an option that there's some of them might not be jewels, but everything's a jewel. Everyone's a jewel. All right. <laughs> we're all very homogenous group. Of, oh no, wait, no, wait, take it back, take it back. We have ooh, we have an angry, we have an angry chow here. So yeah, something a little bit different. There we go. And then we have. Ooh, we got another chow here, which is a little transparent. There we go. So we got a little bit of diversity, but mostly they're all just a bunch of jewels. All right then. So how about let's uh, let us just 
So I guess we'll just uh, go through all these different chow. I mean, it worked pretty well when we were doing the all E ranked chow and uh, looking through the medical charts with that. So let's let let's let's try our luck and be surprised. <laughs> let's go medical medical chart. Let's go. Oh, that is so close. That is so good. Such an energetic chow. Take it easy, okay? That is actually really, really good. Uh, that is amazing. That is- I would nearly take that chow. I would nearly take that chow home with me and name it George or something. I don't know. I'm not going to name it George. <laughs> so what sort of name is that? I'll give a name and name a chow George. No. Um, but I do yosh. I do yosh that hardcore. I am, I am pretty happy about that. Um, so we might get some really good, really good combinations here. I'm really glad about that. All right, let's see. Let's see what you what you're up to. Let's see, chow number two. We're in a medical chow. Uh, not quite. No, no. Nah, that is that is a nope. That is a nope and a half. All right, all right. Um. Okay, this chow. That's got a good face. All right, let's check. This this chow doesn't look very happy with itself, but uh, is it happy? Is it worth looking into its stats? Hey, a, a. Uh, oh, there we go! We have it! We have the chow that we need! All we have to do is reincarnate it, like, twice. Evolve it three times, and we are golden! That- that is beautiful! I'm so glad we have that. I'm really glad. You know what? You know what? Saving! We are saving. Definitely saving. Saving, saving. Um... Let's go, let's go to Tails. Something different. We're changing, kind of changing characters all the time in this episode. Don't, don't mind me with that. Yeah, don't mind me. Okay, so, uh, we have the chow that we need. I need to remember which chow I haven't done yet. Oh, yeah, we haven't, we haven't gone with you yet. Okay, so we have, we have the chow. I, I mean, since we've already got two other... We've got heaps of, um, we, I mean, we've got two other aquamarine chow, we've got vortex and RNGs that we're raising, so I might remove the texture just for the sake of diversity. Um, yeah, nope. That is a nope. But hey, these, these chow, these chow are still pretty good, they're still pretty viable, so even, even the other one that had the one B and the rest of the A's and the S's, that, that could, that chow could do pretty well in newer challenge race, just calling it right now. Actually, let's, let's have a look. Let's have a look at the uh, the more interesting looking chow. So we had we have a green chow. We had that one other random red chow. Yeah. So let's let us look. Let us investigate. No, you're not really quite there. Nope. Again, I do like how this chow looks. It's a nice, nice, nice uh, mix there. I don't know where the colours came from. They just they just sort of appeared or something, something or other. All right, let's, let's look at the red chow, or the reddish pinkish chow. I'm, I'm pretty sure it might be. This might be a red two tone, but it's kind of hard to tell with the, uh, the skin, the skin mod. All right, let's go here. This angry boy, are you worth my time? Not really, unfortunately, because you got the D in stamina. So, oh well. We're trying. We're trying. <laughs> All right, where are we? Uh, where are we? Where, 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 where? We looked at you. I mean, we've already looked at you. I think we looked at you. I oh, know you. You always, you always just have to look the same, so it's kind of hard to tell. Okay, I don't think we've checked you out. Um, okay, you're the one that we're keeping. You, we, you're the keeper. And oh, wait, wait, we have two chair that are that are sad. We have two sad chair. How do I tell the difference? They're they're twins. <laughs> oh God, no. Uh no. I, you, okay, well since we already know we've got the chair that we need, let's just go have a look at Fusion Chair and I'm gonna just look at it right now. Okay, yeah, looking at all these different ones here, there's only one that, that fits the build. There was one that was very, very close with the one B and the A's and the S's, so yeah, so they all they all look yeah, otherwise I'm just gonna pick up the wrong chair. The look I, that is so strange that we managed to get two chair look exactly the same. And then we have this chow here, which is a little bit different. It's like one of these things is not like the others. Anyway, where, where's the one that I wanted? I think I, think I named it something. That's not you. Not you. Oh god, which one? Which is you? No, it's not you. Where, where's the one I want? 
Yeah, this one, this one, this one! This is the one! I called it this one because to make sure this is the chair that we want. Um, this one... I'm not gonna... I'm, not, I'm trying to change its name a bit later. But this one, I'm gonna remove the texture, I think. I'm gonna remove it just to... the jewel is gonna be none. So... be gone! Okay, so this is what it looks like without the texture. Yep, so we, we can... we can... we can uh, use this chair and make into something nice. So what should we do with this one? What typing? We we have the option of uh, swim, run, and fly. So we can do either one. Either either those three. We can do those. Um, I'm really glad that we managed to find this chow so quickly. So I was hoping, I was almost worried that you know we'd find it would take like another two hours or something. But we finally have our potential all S chow, which is really great. So, and with that, with this, unfortunately this one has a bit of a sad face. Uh, unfor unfortunately, it's a bit of a, it's a bit of a, it doesn't really like its existence very much. Even though we're going to, it's going to be achieving great things in the future. So, with that in mind, uh, I'm just going to just chill here for a second and finish things up here. So this has been Sapphire Chow and I am over and out.